don't fucking see me anymore. What does that mean? I've been trying to have sex with you for the past month. Yeah, and I've been working to try to uphold my end of the bargain. What bargain? Rent for this fucking place that you wanted. I, I chose this place because I wanted it to be our home. That's not fucking true. You chose this place so you can brag about it to your friends. You stopped caring. I'm, how has dinner plans led to this conversation? Say you don't even care to talk about it. Okay, fine, fine. Let's talk about this. I want you to fight for this. We fight for this every day. We choose each other every no, day. No, we don't. We pretend to choose. I'm really fucking confused. Where is this coming from? You're so fucking blind. That's good, that's good. That'll help me fight for this. This is coming from rejection. Who's rejecting you? We have two jobs between the both of us. We're fucking adults. So you'll leave our life out for this and then just fucking complain? Who's leaving life out? You, you know, are. I don't speak to my parents anymore because of you and you don't Those speak to are different things. That was your choice. Okay. Your mom hates me. Fine. We're getting off topic. You said you were about to cheat on me and then you said nothing happened. Yeah, but I was the one to take a step forward and he stopped me. And I hate to say it, there's no difference between me wanting to do something and actually doing it. There is a difference. Stop doing that! Stop doing Stop what? Stop being the fucking nice guy for once. Trust me, the last thing I want to do is be nice about this. Why, why can't you just fucking see? See what? See that we're, we're fucking losing! There is no we if you go around fucking other people! I did not fuck him! How do I know? Maybe this is what you wanted. Maybe this is a full fucking plan, you know? You go out on dates with guys you find hot, you get drunk, you fuck them, and then you come home and you say, oh, I didn't want to kiss them. Stop. You want to fight for this? Let's fucking fight. Everything here is on your terms. Your fucking apartment, your dinner plans, your dishes, you wanting to fuck other people. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. Not happening anymore. Why not? He has work he has to finish. Our deadline. Always. Yeah. We know how that feels like. How being cancelled on feels like. No, what a deadline feels like. <laughs> Whose side are you on? I'm just saying, it's, you know, it's a deadline. You know, you and Jonah are quite similar. He never takes my side. Why am I in the same sentence as your boyfriend? <sighs> Relationships are hard. But we choose. And the act of choosing makes it tangible. That's how we exist in each other's given spaces. And how do I exist in your space? I can't answer that for you. Have you ever doubted the thing that feels most familiar to you? Is this the philosophy phase? What? I mean, you know, when you get drunk, you get all philosophical and <laughs> shit. You're not helping! I'm just saying, that's why you're here. Why? To help yourself fight back. You know I like you, right?
Ever wonder why people get uncomfortable in silences? I think it's a social thing. Social thing to get awkward during silence? No. People who are scared often hide behind words. True. Very true. It's such a fascinating thing to be silent in someone else's presence. What fascinates you about it? About how loud our minds get to negate that silence. The boyfriend. <laughs> Sasha. You're trying to fill a void that I'm not big enough for. And neither is he. <laughs> 